Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and my idea of the perfect pamper evening. I'm going to show you the ways I like to relax and chill after a tough day or week and talk you through the products I use including the Soothe and Sleep Dr. Till's Epsom Salts with Lavender, which not only help me relax but also make sure I get a great night's sleep too. I start off by using the Charlotte Tilbury Take It All Off Makeup Remover before washing my face with the Garnier Skin Active Face Wash, which if you've seen my other videos, you'll know I'm a huge fan of especially the smell of it. Next up, I'm using the Clinique Moisture Surge Moisturiser as a face mask by applying an excess amount evenly over my skin and leaving it on for about 10 minutes or so just to really get any moisture I may have lost back into my skin and leave it feeling fresh again. Whilst the face mask is on, I run the bath and add two cups of the Dr. Till's Epsom salts. Because I've used Dr. Till's so many times now, I pretty much know what two cups is just by free pouring. After this, I add a generous amount of the Soothe and Sleep foaming bath to make it super bubbly and relaxing. And of course, it wouldn't be the perfect bath without lighting one of my favorite candles. This one is the Bay Scent by Diptyque. When the tub's full, I get in and I soak for about 20 minutes or so. I find this is just enough time to let the Epsom salts really soak into my skin so I get all the benefits from the essential oils and it really helps to relax my body. To wash, I use the Soothe and Moisturize Body Wash from the same range. And honestly guys, the smell is so good. And personally, lavender really helps me sleep so much better at night. Once I'm out of the bath and have dried off, I use the Relax and Relief Body Oil with Eucalyptus and Spearmint to help lock in as much moisture as possible. Day to day after I shower, I tend to use a cream moisturiser, but for me, after a bath, I just love using something like a body oil because I feel sometimes my skin needs that little extra bit of help just to stay hydrated and stop it from getting too dry too soon. For the past year or so, I always have to have a cup of chamomile tea before I go to bed. I think someone told me that it's actually really calming and can help with sleep and I fidget so much in my sleep that I started drinking it and I'm now absolutely hooked. When I'm in bed, I then apply the Declio face oil to keep the moisture in from the Clinique face mask that I used earlier on and then I use the Tisserand Aromatherapy Rollerball on my pressure points. The one that I've got is called Sweet Dreams and I recently got it in a little beauty pack when I stayed at the Beverly Hilton in LA and, and I just fell in love with the scent so I bought it home and I've just carried on using it ever since. Whilst I'm finishing my tea, I have a final scroll on Instagram before getting off to sleep. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to subscribe and give it a thumbs up and I'll see you next time.